One of the most important places for a witch to keep litter free is the mind. One of the easiest ways to unclutter the mind is to clear the physical space you live in. Your home is your sacred space. It is an extension of you and your world. And when it's disorganized, unkempt or unclean, it's a reflection of what is happening up here and in here. The inner world is where we create and where our personal power and focus lie. And one of the most important things we can do for our practice is clear out the junk physically to make internal space. All of that takes up extra energy that we then don't have for our practice. I've got to start the Rose of Jericho, put herbs in tins, clean the counters, put away jars, relabel tea tins. Oop, banana skins are ready. So when I notice that my external world is out of sorts, then I know that my potency is diffused. So I can take care of the mundane little things that I've been putting off, like cleaning that floor, organizing my kitchen, putting odds and ends away, and giving my space, or temple, an energetic clearing so I can begin anew with better clarity and focus, which are two tools that are at the heart of it. Other ways we must clean house are through exercise and food for our skin suits and meditation for our monkey chatterer of a mind and a way to feel our emotions cleanly. You know, like talking to friends, writing or therapy or, you know, whatever way works for you. Ah, so much better. 